Today I want to take y'all on a journey with me. My friend now has the most expensive house in the world. It's $550 million. And it's the largest house in the world. It's 105,000 square foot. What I love about now is that he care about others. He's about giving back. And he never forgot where he came from. So in life, you go through adversity. God will bless you when you bless others. And this story is the real American dream. This doesn't exist anywhere. One acre, one acre backyard. You might have the biggest house in the world. Yeah, yeah. I got more product than any entertainer in the world. This is where we're going to have the boxing ring. Okay. okay. The first fight we're working on, they want Manny Pacquiao with the Russian. How many square foot is this? Five thousand. You ain't got to say it like that. <laughs> you ain't got to say it like yeah. that, dog. For real. <laughs> you ain't. You ain't got to say this shit like, you know, right. I come from the projects, you know what I'm saying? No, okay, okay. 600 yeah. square feet, sorry. Know, <laughs> this is what I want to tell y'all, I want to let y'all know at home to know this. Everybody got their own level, so I'll let them have this 105,000 square foot. Where'd you get you those fucking lobbies from, man? <laughs> I like those motherfuckers. I just okay. bought these yesterday, now, now okay. you make me, now I'm you, you upstage yourself. me. I'm going to get you some. <laughs> I'm going to get you some. Well, I thought mine were fucking cool, <laughs> you know? At least I can do that for you. I'm gonna get you some glasses. You know what I'm saying? Cause I know that's how people always say, what you get the man that got everything? Nice glass like okay. that, yeah. Yeah, I that's got the key right there. there. You go. But you know what? What I what I really wanted to talk to you about, people don't know the adversity we go through. They just see all this and see everything that, but they don't know. Like for us, Rome, you know, we've been through a lot of adversity, right. but that pain and adversity really pushed us to go chase our dreams and our goals. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And so I know people always, because with, with us, with our culture, we look at who got this or who got what, but sometimes you got to be thankful for what you have yeah. and be, be appreciative because yeah. you got to appreciate what you have. Yeah. And we can't take none of this with us. We can't. We can't. Yeah, not. Like well, that, yeah, that's why, you know, that's why I created this. So I'm going to have the show. Yeah. And the show's going to fuel the PR for the for the uh, pay-per-view events. The pay-per-view events are going to pour money down on me like, like yeah. water. That's what I'm saying. But you, you got to business. But, but you got to business. You're thinking but, of business. Right, but then that is going to go to help everybody in the fucking world. Because how much money you need? I don't need that much. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. fuck. I, you know? so, See? But that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I know. Believe me, I know. So, I know. you got all this technology around you, right? So much more, and that's the other thing. It's a platform for for letting people know about new technology. That's coming yeah. out, you know? So, but you know, I'm, my son go to Tennessee State, and he played basketball. He turned down scholarships from USC, UCLA, all these big schools to go to Tennessee State, which is a, a historical black university. Right? And what I'm looking at, all this technology, man, you know. We might need you to come fix up the arena or something. You know right. what I'm saying? Whatever. Let's and then I'm, I'm thinking about buying a, a house in Nashville. Right. But I don't want it this big. Yeah, no. <laughs> you know what I'm Nobody saying? Nobody so, this big. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, we work so hard, man. We got to enjoy life, too. Fuck yeah. I'm not, uh, yeah. I'm not going to work so hard and then give everything away. I'm yeah. going to have enough to buy whatever yeah. I want, but then help everybody at the same time. Yeah. There's so many different ways I'm going to help them. This is a... Uh, Honey, I wanted the glass to be close, so good to see if we're going to do a tracks. Love in the house. Yeah. It's like, our whole concept is we work hard, so we don't got to leave the house. Yeah. You know? oh, yeah, I feel
guys with the size beauty salon. For all the females watching, y'all get y'all hair done. Nails done, everything. Right in the hair. Right here, right here. Yeah. You want to swim? Check this out. Yeah, this is in no move. You ain't got to go nowhere. It's like, nah, say, no, no. You stay right here and do everything. You got nowhere. This, this, this is the gym. For adults, people don't realize health is well. This is the juice bar. You got to take care of your health. You can't have no living on taking care of your health. Check this one out. This is uh, 10 million bucks for ABD. We can have this. That's what I'm talking about. This is a whole nother house right here. Yeah. <laughs> That's how this whole swimming pool. Okay. It's cool. You know? This is a guest house right here. Here's the ocean and the pool. See, the guest house has its own swimming pool. So y'all know. Well, now I sleep, this is where I'll be here chilling. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be over here chilling at the guest house. Anytime, baby. Yes. Yeah. I love like being able to give back at the same time. You know, okay. Our model, yeah. the more we make, the yeah. more we give, and, oh, yeah. and hopefully our viewers on Master People Views, this inspired them yeah, to yeah. realize that in life you just got to keep growing That's right. and being appreciative yeah. with whatever you have and make That's the right. best out of it. That's There's right. always somebody that might have more than you, but right. happiness don't come from from material right. stuff. You got to yeah. make yourself happy first, That's right. and this stuff is enjoyable. Yep. And the Bible says we we supposed to have nice things if we work hard. Now and people don't realize now like we are stronger together. We have ideas, have dreams and goals, and and being there because like Rome said, we can't take this with us. But being able to do something, make a difference, and help somebody else at the same time, you able to enjoy life is a blessing. Natural, better than, oh, than yeah. anything else. Yeah. You know what? That's what. That's what I tell people in our culture. Everything ain't peaches and cream. You know, some days we might have For anybody hundreds of millions of dollars. Okay. And some days we might have ten dollars, but we don't sit and make the best out of it. We keep going exactly. and we keep building. And that's what real entrepreneurs do. Right. Like every day we get a chance to chase our dreams and our goals and, and get out there and make it happen no matter what. And I think a lot of people want to be bosses, but they don't want to deal with the struggle and the pain. Yeah. And they, they think that that shit, they think know? it's just going to be all great and amazing all the yeah. time. So, you know, for me, my life growing up in the project, having nothing, and being able to help so many people that I've been able to help. That's terrific. And, and it's just a blessing. And I know oh, yeah. that that's why God spared my life, and I'm able to, to, to show people that it's bigger than talent. Like, you're a yeah. developer. Yeah. You know, I'm in the product. Yeah. And so I tell people all the time, get something that you love, and you're passionate about don't don't do it for money because exactly if you love what you're doing the money will come that's right. That's right. you you're a living witness because think about it all of the houses you made when you say you're gonna make this house you know it's like now you got the biggest house in the yeah. world that's crazy <laughs> i don't know how the fuck i do that's what i'm saying but guess what uh, it's you here did it. i'm standing here yeah but you know what? It's nothing but a blessing. And like I told y'all, uh, this is this is this is life. Y'all don't realize that being able to get up and live every day, that's a blessing. Yeah. And to be able to have nice things, that's just another addition to success or whatever you want to call it, but appreciation because I know this man, he can he can live like this and he can live without like this. And that's that's the way I live. That's 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 what's important. Being able to have nice stuff. I think but also no, I can go without. I yeah. mean, because we can't take this with. That's right. <laughs> you know, so and that's why I'm going to use this to give back to everybody. Not yeah. only is it going to make a shitload of money, but it's also going to help everybody in the world. You yes. know? Yeah. Everybody that we can help, we're going to help you. Yeah. You, you see what this is going to be. This is going to make such a thing. I'm telling you, you got friends like this, you're not going to know what you mean. I need a hundred mil. Okay, cool. All right, let's go. I was going to ask you for that. Okay. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Right. This is how we rock. I love what what now stand for and yeah. you know helping other people. That's what our business is about, being a blessing to other people. If you bless others, the blessings will come back to but you. But like now said, that's what I love seeing the mindset of successful people, you know. Yeah. That's what makes you so unique. That's why anybody's successful because the mindset. Yeah. What do you do to get there? And then what are you gonna do once you're there? Yeah. And like he's like, I'm utilizing this. Yeah. You know what? And this, you know, we come from poverty and to be where we at now. 
Like me and now, so we can knock and knock on the door, man. I need a hundred million dollars. Where you, where you want me to send it at? That's crazy coming from the ghetto, but yes. it's love guess is what, real. Money, by the end of the day, you know, money ain't everything. Yeah. You use money and yeah. love people. Yes. People do the opposite. Yeah. And you know, everybody hate on each other, but it took hard work to have this. This man worked for this, and then he talked about using this to bless others.